Hello everyone, this is a Freddy G here back with another deck review. Finally, I am able to get this one done. I was planning to have this one recorded like a month or so before I actually did this recording. But I received the wrong deck from Penguin Magic. They inadvertently sent me the gold one instead of the red one. But now they sent me the red one, so that's good. But this is of course by Sin Lim and put it by Cardi Mundi. And designed by Nick Vlau. It is the third in this uh, edition, uh, in the Regalia decks, the third Regalia, signature edition, it says. With uh, a nice tuck case, it has foil on it, it says Regalia point cards, luxury point cards. And produced by Sid Lin, designed by Nick Flau. On the side, and the other side as well. Top, just some nice artwork. At the bottom, SidLinMagic.com. And the back is this autograph. And it's a two-layered box that pulls out, so that's kind of cool. And here we got a nice spade pip, and his logo, and we get to the cards. The cards are fairly standard. Uh, you do get a blank card. The backs, shiny gold foil on red. It's nice. Maybe silver would have looked better on red, just a little bit, but it's not bad. It's very nice. I do like it. And you do get a duplicate queen of spades, which have custom pips, slightly color on the court cards. And at Jokers, you got this double headed bird with an R in the corner for Regalia, which is cool. Uh, it is, Regalia is a symbol of excellence, prestige, and innovation. And going on with the cards, you got a nice ace of spades. It says Regalia. And the cards came in this order. This is how it came. It's some kind of a stack. I don't know what stack. Or perhaps, oops, perhaps maybe it's not a stack. Perhaps it is a feral shuffle away from a stack. I'm not 100% sure. But custom pips throughout. The court cards are standard, but with, again, a bit of a recoloring, I do believe. Just... More of a gold color to them than usual. But straightforward, standard deck. It is put by Carter Munde. It says it's on an N9 true linen finish, not a true linen B9 finish. It's an N9 instead of a B9. Not sure what the difference is or if it's, that's just a typo or something. But that's what it said, N9 true linen finish with the gold foil on the backs. And... Uh, Crust stock. And it's pretty nice. Thin crust stock. I got no complaints. No real complaints. Nothing really to complain aside from the fact that it took a little bit extra longer to get here, but it finally got here. Overall, I'm going to give this one a solid A. I like, comment, like, subscribe, let me know what you think. Uh, we shall see you next time with more. Thanks for watching. See ya.